welcome to the video lecture series of satellite communication today i will discuss multiple choice questions based on global positioning satellite systems you must have studied gps principle in detail in your course and let me tell you most of the questions will be based on the certain facts and figures so sometimes you need to remember the values as it is let us start first question is global positioning system gps is four options have been given satellite word station satellite system sig satellite signal or satellite solution so you will pick the correct answer very quickly it's a satellite system so correct answer is b question number 2 is global positioning system gps uses 24 satellites in how many orbits 6 7 8 or 9 orbits so it uses 24 satellites in 6 orbits you have studied it this is the correct answer question number 3 is which of the following is based on a principle known as trilateration this is a important principle upon which gps works it means c is the correct answer Question number 4 is GPS satellites are GEO satellites MEO satellites LEO satellites or none of the above You must have heard these terms medium earth orbit low earth orbit so GPS satellites are actually MEO medium earth orbit satellites so correct answer is B Question number 5 is name the satellite provide time and location information for the vehicle and ships what is the name of that satellite gps correct one next question is iridium satellites are options have been given as geo satellite meo satellite leo satellite or none of the above so iridium satellites are low earth orbit satellites means you must tick c as a correct answer question number 7 is name the satellite which can provide direct universal voice and data communication for handheld terminals what is that particular satellites the options are gps iridium teledesis and none of the above so iridium is that satellite which provide direct universal voice and data communication so let us mark b as a correct option question number 8 is name the satellite which provides universal broadband internet access what is the correct answer it is gps or iridium or teledesic or option is not being given over here so c is the correct answer because this satellite provides universal broadband internet access keep remember all these applications this is the correct answer question number 9 is gps was invented in which particular year 1990s 80s 70s or 60s so in 1970s gps was invented actually correct answer question number 10 is which type of transmission gps system uses from satellite to users read this term very carefully gps system uses from satellite to users so that user does not require a transmitter which type of transmission is this this is a one way two way half duplex or full duplex so when there is transmitter not required means this is a one way transmission let us mark a as a correct answer Question number 11 is global positioning system GPS is based on which particular principle so you can pick the answer very quickly trilateration is the principle 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेल्व इज इन केस ऑफ लाइक द टेक्निक यू नो विच इज बींग यूज इन जी पी एस इट मीन्स इट यूज इज हाउ मेनी डिस्टेंसेस टू डिस्टेंसेस थ्री फाइव और सेवन सो इट यूज इज थ्री डिस्टेंसेस लेट एस मार्क बी एज अ करेक्ट आंसर एंड लेट एस चेक एज वेल दिस इज करेक्ट एज वेल क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन इज इन आई एस cellular telephone system uses gps to create time synchronization between what between air stations space stations base stations or land station so correct answer is b in between the base stations question number 14 is when using gps you may expect your position to be accurate 95% of the time to within a radius of certain options have been given 20 meter 40 meter 60 meter or 100 meter so we may expect our position to be accurate 95% of the time within a radius of 100 meter let us check the answer this is correct one question number 15 is when using sorry when navigating using dgps which is differential global positioning system you may expect your position to be accurate to within a radius of 10 20 60 or 100 meter so in case of differential gps we may expect our correct position within a radius of 10 meter let us mark a as a correct answer question number 16 is the modified civilian system that approaches military precision in global positioning is known as it is differential global positioning system means dgps this is the correct answer as well question number 17 is when using gps how many position lines see here we are talking about the position lines are required for a two dimensional fix so three lines are required to fix a two dimensional let us check this is correct next question is when using gps how many position lines are required to fix three dimensional means here by taking into the consideration for altitude as well four lines four position lines are required means the correct answer is d question number 19 is the space segment of global positioning system has how many satellites here we are talking about the space segment so the space segment of gps system have 24 satellites correct one next question is in gps system the method used in locating the position of receiver which particular method is being used you can pick it very quickly let us mark c as a correct answer and check it yes it's a correct one question number 21 is gps satellite transmit frequency known as what is the correct answer l1 frequency l2 frequency either of the above or both l1 and l2 so you must have studied gps system transmit the both the frequencies l1 and l2 it means d is the correct answer question number 22 in gps system pseudo random bit sequence which is known as p code and this p code is used to modulate which particular frequency l1 l2 l3 or any of the mentioned above so it actually used to modulate l2 frequency so b is the correct answer next question which is question number 23 in a gps system c by a code is used to modulate which frequency l1 l2 
either of the L1 or L2 or both L1 and L2. So C by A, this particular code is used to modulate L1 frequency. So A is the correct answer. Question number 24 is to find the location of receiver a GPS system uses. How many satellites? 1, 2, 3 or 4. 4 options have been given. So to find the location of receiver GPS system uses 3 satellites. So C must be the correct answer. Let us check. It is actually. Question number 25 is the satellite signal acquisition by a receiver is governed by Four options have been given, Doppler effect, code synchronization, both of the above options and reason is not mentioned over here. So satellite signal acquisition by a receiver is governed by Doppler effect and code synchronization. It means answer is C, both of the above. Question number 26 is in a GPS system, Typical values within which the Doppler shift must be accomplished. What is that particular volume? Answers have been given as plus minus 4 kilohertz, plus minus 3 kilohertz, plus minus 2 kilohertz and plus minus 1. So here Doppler shift must be accomplished within plus minus 4 kilohertz. So A is a correct answer and you must mark it. Question number 27 is the GPS worldwide satellite network consists of see here various combinations of monitor stations and ground antenna stations have been given and you have to pick the correct one. So GPS worldwide satellite network consists of six monitor stations and four ground antenna stations means answer is D. Question number 28 is the accuracy measurement for a low cost GPS receiver using GPS CA code is known as 1 DRMS error, 2 DRMS error, 3 DRMS error, 4 DRMS error. Here DRMS means distance root mean square error. So DRMS is distance mean root mean square error and it uses actually 2 DRMS error means answer is B. Next question is number of bits in GPS CA code sequences. How many bits? 1024, 1023, 3021 and 3023. So number of bits required actually it's 1023. So answer is B. Question number 30 is the clock rate for the C by A code in GPS system. So what is the clock rate? Clock rate is 1.023 megahertz. You must be remembering it. So just mark A as a correct answer and let us check. This is correct one. Question number 31. Map makers use GPS to verify. Four options have been given boundaries, roads, places or towns. So map makers use GPS to verify actually the boundaries. So A is the correct answer. Question number 32 is airplane and boat pilots use GPS for what? What is the purpose? Navigation, mapping, bearing or limit setting in air or water. So, in both of the cases, the use of GPS is for navigation. A is the correct answer. Question number 33 is, smallest GPS unit is the one. See, out of four options being mentioned over here, which is the smallest GPS unit? Means, it is in airplane, in car, in boats or we can wear on the Rest. So, out of these four options mentioned here, the smallest unit is we can wear on the wrist. Correct answer. Question number 34, which is the last question of this video lecture. Map makers use GIS 2. 
what is the particular purpose store geographic information use geographic information view geographic information and last is store use and view geographic information so map makers use gis to store as well as use as well as view it means the correct answer is d all the three functions needs to be performed let us check the answer this is the correct one so i hope now you will be able to recall the concepts which you have studied in the chapter of gps and as i have told you some of the things you need to learn you have to remember so keep learning so that you can mark the correct answer thank you so much